Hi everyone, it's Kaylee. Welcome back to my channel. I'm glad you're here. Today I have a super fun thrift haul to share with you guys. It is all home decor. It's been quite a long time since I've done just a home decor thrift haul and it is all really fun kind of minimal farmhouse style stuff. I shared on Instagram a while ago that we are in the process of doing a DIY update to our kitchen, mostly painting, adding a backsplash, uh, but in that process we're going to be changing the color scheme from very warm red and oak to blue cabinets and white walls and white shiplap backsplash. So it's definitely going to be more my style, more kind of white and blue and cream and lots of that kind of natural farmhouse feel. So I definitely wanted to head to the thrift store and pick up some new uh, dishes and serveware and a couple of things we just didn't have yet. The first thing is this gorgeous white pitcher. I just loved the detail on it. It felt like it was, you know, a little bit special, but nothing too frilly. I think that kind of really describes my style well. In particular, this kind of bead line here was perfect because a couple of my dishes have that same kind of pattern on it. So I think they will look like they came together and they didn't. I found a set of six of these ramekins for 60 cents each. I was thrilled to find these because I keep running across recipes that you're supposed to cook or bake in ramekins and I didn't have any. So now I have a set of six of them and it was really affordable. I have been looking for a cookie jar at the thrift store for what feels like forever, and I finally decided to get just this really simple white canister. I don't think it was intended to be a cookie jar, but I just like that it doesn't have, you know, sugar or flour or some other label on it. I also snagged this blanket. It has tons of gorgeous texture to it, and I thought this would just be a really good throw for our living room as we update the kitchen to be more of a blue and white and taupe color palette. I wanted to make a few little tweaks to our living room as well because it's open concept. So I thought this would be a good throw to have down there. I found this beautiful, I guess it's like more of a crock. It actually looks like it would have fit into a crock pot because it's got this big lip on it, but I'm not really sure what it was originally. It's just a gorgeous bowl with the perfect colors on it and I thought that this would be a good serving piece for something like mashed potatoes or a large sort of vegetable side. I found these really really big cream mugs. I mean they are like you could have a bowl of soup out of this um, but they are just a beautiful color, a nice kind of creamy off-white. Another bit of dishware I found is this set of salad plates. Here they've got that kind of dot pattern on it that looks very similar to the pitcher. I thought that they would tie in well together and these would be great as uh, salad plates or dessert plates. I was looking for a single taper candle holder. They have these in abundance at the thrift store. I thought the shape of this was just really uh, pretty and quite simplified. For some variety, I also picked up these two candlesticks. Again, just simple taper sized. I thought that they weren't too frilly looking, but I love that they're kind of an antique brass color. This next piece is a little bit unique and I'm not 100% sure what I'm gonna put in it yet. I thought that this was just so beautiful and it would be kind of an interesting piece to put over on our coffee table or maybe on our bookshelves to pull that blue color from the kitchen into the living room. I picked up this cute little hook set uh, to put by our back door and hang our keys on it. We're currently just using some 3M hooks, which works totally fine, but it does give a little bit of that temporary dorm room feeling. So I thought that this hook set was just a little bit more special than that. I really want to incorporate some natural wood accents into our kitchen just to break up uh, all of the white and blue, and there's going to be a lot of painted surfaces there. So I got just a simple wooden spoon. I'm gonna have a crock of these sitting on the counter just to bring in a little bit of that warmth that wood can bring to a space. And then this was really fun. I found a wood mortar and pestle. I thought that that was just so cute. And we've actually talked about getting one of these for a while and just never thought that it was worth the price for how often we would use it. But for thrift store prices, I think it's worth it. The last few pieces I found are all table linens. So first is this gorgeous white linen. 
I believe they're placemats, but they are very large. So I am planning to cut these in half and make a set of four white linen napkins out of them. They just feel really amazing and I think they'll be kind of luxurious fabric napkins. I also found this set of two fabric placemats. I also spotted this in their fabric section. It is a table runner with some cute fringe and some really great texture to it. I thought that since most of my dishes are white and cream and kind of that ceramic look, having something with some texture and some rich color would look really nice under that. That is everything for this very large farmhouse style home decor haul. Tons of amazing dishes and serveware and table linens and things. I'm just super excited with everything that I found and I'm really surprised that I found this all in one day. It was two different stores, but within about an hour and a half of thrifting. So super amazing trip. I can't beat that. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. If you enjoyed it, please give it a thumbs up or leave me a comment to let me know. If you want to see more videos from me on thrifting, DIY, and a capsule wardrobe, you can subscribe down below. And until next time, I will see you guys over on the blog or in my next video. Bye!